Hey guys, it's Terry FD Official here and tonight I'm going to show you how to prepare yourself a juicy, cold, natural protein shake. Once you come from the gym and you want to recharge your muscles so that you can benefit your body wholesomely. Yeah! Let's go! For the ingredients, you need some ground nuts, a glass jug or mtungi of milk, some water, not less than three bananas, and a powerful blender. These are the key ingredients to make yourself that juicy, cold, natural protein shake. I typically start by adding the groundnuts. Now you can either use them with the outer covering or without. Me, I prefer them with the outer covering. This is because there's that sweet and sour taste I'm looking for. So you just put in the groundnuts. It's followed by the bananas, the nicely chopped up bananas. You can put them whole in the blender if you want, but just prefer to chop them up so that the blender can have a smooth process as it makes the protein shake. Later on, I add uh, a glass of milk. Yeah. With a glass of milk, I take a glass of water place it in the blender so uh, this will ensure that the mixture is not too thick at the same time it's not too what can you call it it's not too thin yeah you get what I'm saying so uh, after this now complete the, the, the mixture yeah, let's go. Yeah, so after you put your ingredients in the blender, you can now start blending for approximately three to five minutes. I usually like taking intervals as I blend. Uh, this makes sure I'm not putting too much stress on the blender. At the same time, it gives that mixture, that thick taste and finish. I also follow my process so that your mixture can mix well. By giving it intervals, it means that uh, you're giving the mixture layers so it also becomes thick, tasty, and leaves that good taste in your mouth. If you have kids, don't let them play with a blender. It's a very, very dangerous appliance. So make sure when you blend, you blend it until all the. That is if you decide to use the groundnuts with the. With the outer coverings, make sure when once you blend, you make sure that all of the brown particles are completely blended as as more as small as possible. Now 
Now, as you can see, there are no brown particles or outer coverings left in the mixture. Looks clean, but I'll give it one last more, one more last blend. Then I'll show you the finished product. So for a protein shake, you can use so many ingredients, but two of the key ingredients I like to use are groundnuts, bananas, and milk. And milk, milk is the third actually. So that's uh, groundnuts, bananas, and milk. Those are three of the the key ingredients I like to use. But you can add other things on top of the three, like uh, for example, other fruits. You can even add, uh, let's say, watermelons, pineapples. That's a healthy, natural protein shake that you eat. So I'm about to taste the protein shake. But before I do, please make sure you like, share and subscribe. Wow! Yeah! Let's go!